What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. Where the cookers and shit. He gonna tell her, him downstairs. Who the f is him? Like I ain't got no name or something. Him downstairs. The two year old said, I go get this shit myself. Drivers, 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 be safe. Be safe out there. Anything liable to happen, anything could change in the blink of an eye. Quick clip right here from TikTok as always. Here's a driver doing the driving thing. And then out of nowhere, life changes for the driver and for the driver of the car that was in a bad accident. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Well, there you have it, drivers, right there. Just just, just look at the devastation of what this car has caused. And it's going to be like, hey, it's going to be the driver's fault. Everybody in the comments is saying, yo, it's the driver's fault. The driver's not paying attention. The driver should have seen the car coming up on the side. Yada, yada, yada. But... The car came out of nowhere, as you can see in the camera. Like the driver was in his lane. He wasn't veering off. He was he was doing the damn thing. All of a sudden, the car came from came from the left, clipped him, flipped over a couple of times, forced it the driver off the road and hit the car again. Now I want to say, uh i hope everybody in that situation is all right uh, as we can see the driver is is all right but hopefully the driver of the car or the or the people that was in the car is all right now of course the driver is going to have to go through a lot of stuff he has to go through a drug test probably an on-scene drug test to make sure that he wasn't up under the influence then they're going to go back to the camera. They're going to see, you know, what, what he was doing, if anything. And as we could see, he wasn't doing anything that distracted him or anything. He was just driving, paying attention to the road. And all of a sudden, the car came from his left and, and just messed the whole thing up. After that, of course, they're going to, you know, they're going to get the you know the the testimony of of the driver and the car you know of course the car gonna probably say hey the driver veered over into my lane which forced me to do what i did yada 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 and then of course you're gonna have the driver's version of the story of you know just exactly what he was doing in the camera and probably maybe about a month month down the line you know he's gonna be found you know not responsible for the accident but of course it's still gonna show up on his DAC report as as a probably a non-preventable but it's still gonna show up on his DAC report now the company got access to this camera as you guys can see and they could see that their driver really wasn't doing anything but driving he wasn't distracted both hands on the wheel and he was being focused on the road until the accident happened so should the driver you know should the driver lose his job because of this accident i doubt it but then again it depends on the company that he was driving for but i i hope that the driver did not lose his job if he did lose his job hopefully he's able to have access to this camera so he can show the next company that he applied for and be like look this is what happened and i didn't cause the accident drivers let me know your thoughts in the comments below
Thank you.